Bravo Gaming Club Wars Pickup Episode Five? Season two. Season two. Damn right. What's up with the phone? It didn't ring. It didn't ring. It didn't ring. No one wanted to talk today. No shit. No shit. But it did work last week, remember? Jordan came. Yeah, but he could have just showed up. No, no, no. You don't know that. You don't know that. Welcome, guys. We are a weekly pickup show of all sorts of media varieties. My name's Dan. That's my brother Ryan, if you're new to the channel. My name's Ryan. We share the same last name. It's O-Day. O apostrophe D-A-Y. We pick up all kinds of fun stuff. The thrift store is open this week. That's crazy. It is kind of crazy. I went out... Uh, it is like packed today. It looks packed. Yeah, but if you go first thing in the morning, it's alright. The only thing bad that's happening right now is there's a couple... You can tell they're strictly resellers because they go in with two shopping carts and they're just fucking throwing everything into these carts. Oh, that defeats the purpose. Well, it makes it a little more difficult. So I saw a bunch of crappy PS2 games sitting there and uh, I left them and then I came back and I saw they grabbed the whole stack and threw them in their cart. Oh, good luck. Yeah, have fun with that. Have fun reselling those, guys. Need for speed fucking no, no, it wasn't even wasn't even that good. Wasn't even that good. I, I'm trying to think what it was. FIFA. Uh, uh, there was a beach volleyball game, but it like wasn't one of the good ones. Wasn't a good game. No, yeah. it was one of the shitty ones that you wouldn't spend more than two dollars on. And these games are obviously three seventy five or I something. Know. Not even worth it. So, but we did get some pickups at the thrift. These are fresh. This is all I found. I found this Springsteen seven inch one step up. It's from 1988. I'm not really familiar with it. What is it? Tunnel of Love era, maybe. Uh, Lucky Town. Yeah, that looks like that shirt. Found Pet Shop Boys, West End Girls. Shit. Awesome. We get Jordan to sing that? I wish. I told him to come over, see if he, you know, shows up. And uh, Billy Idol, Eyes Without a Face. Which is probably the coolest one out of all of those. I like that one. I do. I love that song. I love Billy Idol. I mean, you like that look. I do. Who doesn't like that look? I think I heard him just come in. Okay. Jordan! Yeah. Jordan! Hey, Jordan! Jordy! Okay. Jordy, hi, roller! A weird segue. Is that race car? <sighs> Rally car, boys. Rally What's car. Uh, once again, I don't know. I don't. Woo! It's Jordan. not coming. But. Oh, that was the. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you reverse it? Check this out. Flip I got down. my own pickup this week. That's a crisscross uh, criss cross cassette. <laughs> that's funny. You just found that on my stairs as you were walking down. No, man. That's fine. John, what's, this, what's the hit? So, yeah, that one. To which, I hate children vocals. John, can you uh, sing uh, West End Girls for like a little... West End Girls. Doom, do, do. Mm, mm. I don't... Uh, There's a murder ribbon. Got a package this week from Richard Bryan Khan. RBKs. Yeah, we've been doing trades. We've been trading a lot lately. And, uh, well, he found some stuff in his thrift. What did he find? Disney's Noah. Did you, did you, sanit did you sanitize these? No, I'm trusting fam, uh, kid. <laughs> Fuck, no, I ain't touching them. I don't know what these are. That was Tony Danza. <laughs> Tony Danza. <laughs> Noah. Uh, we got the North Avenue Irregulars. Oh, my dick. These movies, Disney movies from the 70s, Hard so odd. They are hard to find, oh, but... There's a shit ton of weird ones in there. They're all weird. Gone are the days. Another wacky comedy. Is she a whore in that scene? Oh, yeah. We got... It's the, called Prostitutes. The horse in the gray flannel suit. Ooh. This has Dean Jones. He was a big Disney star. He's in a lot of those. You recognize him? Mm. Not really. No. Kinda. Yeah, yeah. Was he in the... What else was he in? Herbie. Was yeah, it, was he yeah, in that's what I Original Herbie's, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was he in Brink? No, he's not in Brink. <laughs> he doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah, he's a soul skater. <laughs> Family Band. This looks tacky and wonderful. John Lovitz. Oh, yeah, that looks bad. The Sign of Zorro. Oh, I like Zorro. Yeah, me too. <laughs> so those are all Disney fam. Thank they you got, very much. They're, I, they're in the big clan. That's cool if I drop them. The clan. Yeah. I don't want to hold those for honest. Oh, I, he also sent along this uh, 
four-way multi-tap here. Oh, shit. Is that PS2? Yeah, it is. Do they each have a fucking memory card? Memory card, card yeah. Dude. I didn't know that. Out of they every, all have them? Out of everything I've ever found, I've never come across a PS2 four-way multi-tap. Do you even want this? I do. We can play four-player games. Oh, it's one and two. Speaking of four-player games, did you guys watch the pilot episode we aired last week? Yeah. I remember that. I was there. Which one was that? That was six years ago. That was the Sega Bass Fishing. Oh, yeah. I wasn't there. That was before Jordan. How old were you back in 2014, Jordan? 20. You were 20. I was 20. Oh. Damn, man. Hey. What, you got any things to say about that, that episode? <laughs> Nothing. I think you already heard what I said. <laughs> Why don't you say it? Uh, Dan was real fat there. Yeah, see, I made... You look amazing now, but back then you were funny to look at. Hey. Yeah, same. We got Alien Storm. He sent that along. You ever uh, play Alien Storm on the, the Genesis? Rona. No. I haven't played much Genesis. This is a, uh, a beat em up. Oh, really? Yeah. Looks like a shooter. What do we got in here? The cooler. We got nothing in here. Wow. We got nothing so, in that. Shit. Uh, we got Dracula. Dracula. I never fucked around with Dracula in the Genesis. It's a Dracula. Wait, you're not playing that? I'm gonna play. You ain't never gonna play. Don't lie to me. You even got a fucking Genesis anymore? Yeah, I do. It's upstairs. I don't have a 32X, but it didn't stop me from uh, saying, hey, fam, hook me up with that motocross. Damn. It's true. It's probably six. six. KB no. Toys had that for $39. It's the thing they added to the Genesis. Yeah. What the fuck is a Turbo Graphics? Like that? I've like, never seen one. Is there like 30 games? That's not Turbo Why is that graphics? Minty? Fam got a bunch of 32X in one of his hauls recently. It's from KB. It is from KB, which is even more nostalgic. I, I would have stolen that had I been familiar with the 32X at the time. She stole all of them. Uh, and he sent a, he used to sell shit. a little guard for a 32X game, and I got a couple upstairs. Oh, shit. So. He would steal shit and then sell it. I'll flip it like an asshole. I actually would. Yeah, I know. I stole a case. You told me about I, it. I stole a case of four x four off-road games on the PS One. A full 30, 30 games, a case of them, and sold them all within a year. I was getting like 30, 40 bucks a pop for a shitty game. The whole case, though. Yeah, it was brand new, so people still wanted it. I uh, didn't order. I ordered online on Amazon for twelve bucks. So you didn't order. The Kyria did... Chronicles. Ordered this. Did, didn't he just say I didn't it's, order this? Oh, that's the first one. I did order it off of weird. Amazon. Yeah, he said it's Why'd you say all weird? weird? I say everything backwards. I try to come up with my own phrases, but... <laughs> I was playing this like two or three weeks ago. It's still really good. I'm saying top five game all time. One of these days I'm gonna fucking beat it. <laughs> you haven't even played it. I have played it. How much? An hour and a half. Did you get a tank? Maybe. Did you get a tank and then never use it like I do? <laughs> I just use it for cover. Yeah, I, I never use, use the fucking tank. You never use the tank. But uh, I want to beat this. I played it on the PS4. I put in 30 hours, and then I thought I saved it on a flash drive because I erased my PS4. And then come to find out, I wasn't really able to save. So Imagine that. You were playing RPGs. Yeah, this is wonderful. So I'm going to... It's good tactics. I'm going to buzz through. I'm gonna, yeah, it's, it's so good. Story's great. Art's incredible. Yep. Uh, also picked up some stuff off Best Buy that had a sale. I think these were like seven bucks a piece. First up, we got this Kododama, The Seven Mysteries of Fujisawa. Sawa. God, I love Asian shit. It's a visual novel, but with a Connect 3 kind of bullshit thrown in there. Is there, oh, candy is there, is there at least some hentai in there? I don't know. And that company. It's T, so. That, that PQ. Oh, not PQ. They're all about the, tea, the visual novels. But T in China's like. Crazy. What? Rated T in China. Is oh. That makes sense. Stop making visual novels. There's no reason to have a... Get fucking, on that soapbox. There's no reason to have a physical release for a fucking visual novel. Well, for seven bucks, I was like, whatever. It's loose in there. Yeah, that's great. Just scratch uh, it around. Picked up some VR games, because I, I like beefing it up at seven bucks a pop. First, we got this smash hit plunder. And supposedly you can play VR with this and then have up to four players not playing VR also get involved. No. Oh. So it's a party game somehow, some way. I'm not sure how it works. I mean, that's a good idea. Uh, dreams. 
Isn't that a great idea? That's a good idea. Dreams is a great idea. I have one person in VR. Yeah, then, and then the rest of people watch the TV. It's like uh It's like that. It's like the Mario the game. Yoshi game, yeah. Yep. Stupid. And then so we I'm also good. got everybody's golf VR. I have the standard game. I've played this the demo and I had fun with it. Like you're in the world golfing. Dude, golf games are great. That golf story game looks great. I gotta play that sometime. It does look good. You know, I was so inspired by the old oh. VR this week. I decided you know what we should do? We should break out the instruments and do a little jam. I think Yes Ayasha could sing it for us, too. Oh, oh. VR? All right. You ready to do it? Yeah. Yeah. Come on, join. So you guys what saw, you speaking of non-video games, uh, my buddy John, you saw earlier episodes during this whole pandemic, he hooked it up with a bunch of shit. We got some more shit from him. I'm just getting around to showing. He hooked it up with a bunch of autographed jerseys. Is that big? Can we, we, put, can we put one on Jordan? That looks fucking big. No, I don't want to wear it. Please, let's go. I don't even like sports. Let alone that team. Sure, this guy sent his dick out to people. Yeah, his Ooh, dick too. It was a really big dick, too. Who is he? It's Brendan Spikes, man. Oh, that actually... That might be small. That is small. Either way, put it on. It's an XL, I can fit in that. I don't want to wear it. So, he sent his dick out. I don't think you're getting pads under that, homie. That's good. Ow! Oh, it's got one of those right Oh, yeah. Ah! <laughs> Don't move. Oh, it's like one. Okay. You get it? Yeah. Oh, it's so embarrassing. Well, that's fine. <sighs> you look like a football player now. I look like I'm wearing pads. All right, so that, that's a... You know, you always have pads. All right, so that's a Brandon Spikes. Uh, what else do we got here? We got a... Oh, good, there's more. There's a Rodney Harrison jersey oh, autograph. Rodney? Let's put that on me, too. Let's <laughs> keep layering them up. Uh, who is this, Ryan? Did we establish? Right there, man. Hey, it's Spike's... Patton. Again. David Patton. That's 86. He's a receiver. Uh, any of you guys that played Tecmo Bowl, Super Tecmo Bowl on the NES? What's his number? Irving Five? Fryer. Irving Fryer was in that game. Yeah, he was, he was good. On the Patriots. It was awesome. Who was the quarterback? Uh, Montana. Is it Steve? Well, funny you say that because there's also a Steve Grogan oh, autograph. Shit. Segway. It, that was a segue. That, that was, was good. I don't know any quarterbacks. Tom Brady. Uh, Eli. Eli Brady? Manning. And, the, and uh, there was a, there's a couple more, but I don't know much about them. But the last one is probably my favorite one out of the bunch, and that is a Brian Cox autograph jersey. This is what they wear on the field, then? Is it like the same material and stuff? Yeah. Really? Yeah. It's uncomfortable. Sure. So Brian Cox was a linebacker for the Patriots and also, who else? It's the Chiefs. Bills. Dolphins. Bills. That's close. And he's, he's known for the biggest thing he ever did was when he went out in the, the 50 yard. He came out and was flipping off the fucking crowd and they're all booing him. Oh, shit. You, you don't remember that? No. Oh, he fucking went to the... He's just like flipping the whole... Wait, can you find some fan footage? It's weird. It's hard to find now. Was he in an away game? I, I'll, I'll find the photo, but that's why that one's the coolest by far. You feel good, don't you? I feel terrible. It's, 
feels gross. So John, thank you so much. Damn, John. These are awesome. Yeah, thanks, John. Yeah, you see that shit? It's signed. Oh, don't do that. <laughs> wipe it off. <laughs> I licked it and wiped it. Uh, cut here. Here, can you help me take it off? I don't want to ruin the, the thing. Ugh. Don't be weird. I'm just fucking... I'm trying! You've definitely taken a girl's shirt off like this. Stop being gay. Thank you. <laughs> oh, sorry, that's usually what happens after I take the oh. shirt off. <laughs> I was just in the zone. Sorry, man. Oh, did you guys, uh... We got a special guest this week. No, I don't, we don't know what that is. Sometimes we have guests on to show us their pickups. And this week, Jerps93 sent, uh, sent some pickups in. Pick up, Him and his dad. So we're going to play that real quick. Hey guys, Jerps 93 here. Picked up a bunch of shit last week, so <laughs> that's all we need. Video. Stop it. Uh, <sighs> Scott, Squatch, and I went out, did some uh, garage sales. Went to some garage sales last week. Picked up a few dope C uh, DVDs. And, um, got some Hanna Barbera. I remember that. I remember that show. Wacky Races season one. <laughs> I know you do because you're old. Nice. <laughs> And even better, I picked up seasons one and seasons two of the Flintstones. Oh, those guys didn't know what Where to do with Betty Wilma. I would have showed them, let me tell you. <laughs> Next one I got is 40th Anniversary Edition. Now that's a funny show. And the Holy Grail. Yeah, it really is. It's even got cows. It is. That's a classic. And... The last one, the last DVD I got is a copy of Jane Fonda in Barbara. I like her. She's 80 years old. She's, she's still hot. It's true. Is there, that's, that's weird. It's true, though. Um, the only thing I got is I got a real dope addition to my Dreamcast collection. I got a two box, and I got semen. Ha! <laughs> That reminds Stop me of last week when I was on. No, don't, don't. Just uh, talking about your erections well, I'm again. I'm 57. For Pete's sake, I'm going to be proud of it. I'm comfortable. Uh, oh, we also went out to some flea markets, and I managed to pick up. I'm wearing one of them. I picked up a couple great hats. Both Montreal Expos hats. I'm sure, Papa Pete probably loved the Montreal. What's he know about those? Are hockey? He's Canadian. This hockey. Well, they're not hockey. This one's even got ear flaps. I guess it is a Canadian hat. Yeah, it's got ear flaps. Neat. And I picked up. There was this card mounted to a mounted to a board. See it? Do you know who it is? Jerry Kuzman. Anyway, there it is. Who's I Jerry Kuzman? It's pretty neat, so I picked it up. I only paid like three dollars for it. And uh, the last thing I got at the flea market was this really pretty dope racing picture. Yeah, I, I don't know who that was. Doobie. It was autographed. What's Doogie? Racing. I know. I know. Well, your name's Doogie. And, uh, Dad also picked up some stuff in the garbage. Yeah, I got, uh, I got a Wii, uh, but just a box. There's no Wii in it, of course, because somebody's too lazy to, like, find somebody to give the box to them one. They haul it out to the side of the road, so I have to haul it away, for Christ's sakes. Lazy, won't get off the couch. Last thing is, I got this dope pin for 50 cents. Well, uh... I guess that's all the pickups for this week, guys. So uh, that's it. See you guys. Peace out. What the fuck was that? Damn it. Something seemed off there. It was a little too good. It Jerps was... didn't see him himself in that. It was like those pubes were glued on. Yeah, something was it off. It's like he gained like 30 years. But, you know, either way, that was a good pickup. Thank you very much. I adopted an accent. <laughs> uh, Don't air. Last bit of pickups. You guys know I've been collecting on the records because I love me some vinyl. We're oh, going on the record. Going on I love records. Yeah, you've been collecting it. Come on, <laughs> give me that. You suck. Give me that. First record I ordered was this choking victim. No gods, no managers. Oh, I love it. Is that the good one? Oh, oh this, so is good. this is it. This the, is so good. If you like Scott Punk, this What's is. That? What's their head? Even if you don't. Hold you on. Like this. Hold on. Hold on. Can, sorry. Can I fucking read it? All of them. Yeah. Crack rock steady. Uh, we got this. What is this, Ryan? It's uh, Ryan Adams. That's uh, it's 29. 
which is one of my least favorite yeah, albums. Yeah, it's pretty low on there. The, uh, Piano Ballads. It's the last one of that he's released in one year, and it was definitely the... The least. Yeah. The Taylor Cold Sunday. Roses. No. It was a song of the same year. It's much better. Wipers, Youth of America. Wipers are an awesome band. Another From right. Portland. A lot of people don't know about them. From Oregon the early 80s. Not me. <laughs> Not me. Not me. This is before Portland, Maine was a thing. Got another Wipers record. I didn't know that was recent. I didn't know that. Uh, before it started popping, you know? Oh, okay. And the last album the New York Dolls released a couple years ago oh. was this Dancing Backwards in High Heels. I thought that was a No Doubt record. No, no, but this New York Dolls album is... You like it? I love this album. Surprisingly good? Surprisingly really good. This is the, the third of the, the comeback records. Mm -hmm. And this is by far the best one, in my opinion, that is. Woo! It was like 12 bucks right now. <laughs> Joe Hanson. Psh, psh, Joe Hanson. Uh, what was this? Uh, Buster Poindexter? Yeah, Buster name? Poindexter. Jo jo Did you know that one? Joe Hanson. Who? He had an alter, uh, alter ego. He, did, he had a really popular song. He did have one. His he had a guy. He made a character up, Buster Poindexter. What was the song? Hot, yeah. hot, hot. Dun 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 dun. You fucking know that song. Yeah, but the fucking he did it. Yeah, yeah. That's weird. Yeah, <laughs> that's super weird. The biggest hit. Yeah, boy, well, probably did make the most money off of that. So, pretty neat <laughs> little stack of records right there. They do it in blackface. I don't think so, Joe. That's insensitive right now. You can go on Facebook. There's a lot of people doing it. I don't support them. Wait, they're going blackface? Dude, there's so much blackface right now. It's fucking insane. I haven't seen that. You don't need to. They no. suck. Hey, man, don't move. You missed a bit. Thanks, man. Yeah, Appreciate cat that. hair. Appreciate that. Yeah, I'm going to well, have a lot of that. I have black shirt on. Uh, so that's going to wrap it up. Friday. That's, that's, that's it. That that's the yeah. That's the pickups this week. All right. Is there anything you want to say or talk about? Um. Yeah, I'm looking for tactical RPGs on the Switch. If you have a comment, that could tell me about a game. Or did you? What's uh? What would that game that I was telling you about? Well, be? the best part about the eShop is if you go, you can you search can't. genre. It doesn't do it that Strategy. Well. It's, it's pretty bad. No, I've, Dude, been, I've been doing it. I've been doing mess. it, too. It is a mess. And I'm like, no. I no. had no issue with it. Play the Power Rangers game on the eShop. Oh. It's fun. It's a good fighting game. Jordan's challenging all you bums. Ryan's going to come play it at my house after this. Gold Ranger all day. Dude. Green Ranger. Fuck. Eh. Turquoise Ranger. <laughs> they, Fuck if they Power ever Rangers. see this... Make more characters. Goldar. Goldar sucks. Goldar, somewhere in this If room. you see this, um, please cancel that game and never make another one. Well, I already own it. Just keep adding characters. I unlocked Lord Someone Zed. Wait, did you buy the physical or just download? I just download it. He just downloaded it. I'm not going to buy it. Where's he going to go and buy it? Best Buy. I don't go Oh, he's going to he's gonna ask him to go pick it out for him? Yeah. No, dude. Just go online and they'll I got. I know people up. that work there. I don't care for them. Call him Are out. you talking about Nick Sage? He doesn't work there anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Nick's fine. All right, that's it. Bye. What? Well, you, we're wrapping up. We're wrapping up. Uh, until next week, uh, comment down below and the you know let Ryan know about strategy games on the eShop. And um, go watch Inside Kids, please. Yeah, please. <laughs> no one else is. <laughs> is. Is that bad right now? I don't know. I don't check the numbers anymore. I don't, I don't even watch makes it. You, makes you a sad boy. <laughs> oh, you don't even watch it? No. That's bad when you don't watch it. Do you watch this? Yeah. See he what works. He doesn't. I do. Don't look at my history? You watch I, it? No. I used to watch. Well, you watched. First hundred, hun, first hundred episodes I watched. Well, those well first, you edited them. Those so first, you do watch them. Those yeah, first but... first hundred ones are real good, though. So good. Yeah. Glory days. What happened? Lost, lost our talent. Triple A and uh, Little Rock Tomahawk. We became hacks. Lost Nick Sage, man. Hey, someone said that, two people said that your mustard scene was disturbing. That's fine. But I don't have to fucking watch it. You were trying to make money. That's true. I'll do don't anything. Don't knock the hustle. Money. It's fucking insane. So if you have $3 and you want Jordan to perform that stunt for you, Dude, just that uh, so let us know in the comments. It was really funny. He'll do it with ketchup? Tabasco? Uh, preferably nothing spicy, except for grain mustard. Ow. On that note, goodbye. I think he's coming.
I had this game once. Then my dad got a job. <laughs>